Hello everyone and welcome back into my kitchen. Come with me, let's make this simple, healthy, but delicious breakfast. All right, so here are our ingredients, really simple. And here I have about three quarters of a cup of egg whites. I have a half of a small shallot that I diced, one mini bell, red bell pepper. I have a few leaves, let me see, one, two, about four or five leaves of um, basil. And here I have a few slices of goat cheese. I don't know how many ounces. I'm going to say this is about three or four tablespoons worth. All right, let's go over to the stove. So here in my frying pan, I have one tablespoon of olive oil. You can use butter if you wanted to. And I'm going to add in my veggies and give this a chance to saute and release its flavors. All right, so my vegetables have had a chance to saute and I may not have said that I added a half a teaspoon of salt and half a teaspoon of black pepper to this. I apologize, but I did. All right, let us give this a chance to go. I'm still here on about medium high. And I'm gonna add in, I chopped up my basil. I'm gonna add my basil in at this time. And I'm just gonna put a lid on this. And let it go for a couple of minutes. All right, it's been about a minute and I'm gonna add in my goat cheese. And if you're following a low carb or ketogenic diet, this is a very good breakfast option that does not spare any of the flavor. All right, let's lift this back up and let it go until the uh, egg is set. All right, let's take a look at this. Look at that. Let me get this plated up so you can see. There we have it. And like I said, if you're doing low carb or keto, this is fantastic. The fat in the cheese will keep you very full for quite a long time. I hope you guys give this thing a try. It smells fantastic. Thank you so much for stopping by. I'm not gonna taste this one today because I've been doing a lot of tasting today and I'm full. But I know this is gonna be fantastic. It's healthy, it's packed full of flavor. Give this thing a try, guys. Thank you so much for coming back. I sincerely appreciate you. And I look forward to you visiting again when I promise to make another delicious recipe. Bye-bye.